Hey guys, what's up? This is JRP77 from JGN Games, and I'm going to be doing kind of an introduction to a new tutorial series I'm doing, but also kind of starting a tutorial series on my, I'm uh, not series, just a series in general about my favorite Blender add-ons. So, I decided that I was scrolling through my recommended videos on our YouTube channel, and I came across this. This is a modifier called Hard Ops. Now, basically, Hard Ops allows you to do stuff like greebling and all these stuff. I mean, you can see up here that He's done some really cool things with holes and helmets. Basically what it is, is it's a hard surface modifier. Now, basically a hard surface modifier is, it allows you to do details like this and stuff that you wouldn't normally do in stuff like, I don't know, some stuff you would normally do in sculpting. But he's made this awesome modifier, so I would, figured I would show this off as part of a new series on my favorite add-ons, but also this is kind of like an intro into a tutorial series I'm going to be doing on this modifier. I mean, not modifier. I keep thinking modifier. It's an add-on. Um, it's going to be fun. It's got some really cool stuff in it. I mean, he's got some really cool videos on his channel. Um, he's got some really good documentation, but I don't see... A, but a lot of the stuff is aimed at people who use Blender all the time and are essentially masters at Blender. And so, I figured, why not make a series on how to do stuff? So, what I'm going to be doing in this is time-lapse modeling this. Now, this is just a fairly simple crate, but I'm going to try to make it look pretty similar to this. I mean, the handle I'll probably do as a separate object, but you get the idea. Um, I'm not going to do any sculpting. This is all the modifier, and so in the next part of the video, I will be doing the time-lapse. <laughs> Alright, so in just under 28 minutes, that's right, 28 minutes, we got a pretty accurate replication of this picture that I used. Um, this picture was most, um, I just found it off the internet, but just judging by the detail, it's got some scratches on there and stuff, it looks sculpted, um, but just by doing something really quick, I think I got um, a good result. Now you will notice that I did not in fact do the same pose so you can't really tell but just judging by that weird angle I think that that turned out really well. I also didn't do those hint I did do a few things like the I did the screws on top and I did I didn't do that but honestly that looks really good so that was the hard ops modifier. I highly suggest you guys go get this modifier, especially before we go and start this tutorial series. It's a great add-on to have. It's great for hard surface mod modeling. I got that done really quick, and this is my first few days working with it and just getting used to it. I mean, I think I just figured out how to do most things. 
So yeah, thanks for watching this um, introduction, I guess. Um, hope you guys like this modifier. Don't forget to check out Master Xeon 1001's Hard Ops add-on. Um, it's for sale. There will be a link in the description to go check that out. So cool. I'll be starting a new tutorial series next um, this Friday. Um, so don't forget to go check that out. Friday at 12 o'clock, this series will be starting. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys next time.